My dear child, listen with your heart and take to heart this deep message. I know about your pain and want to help you. Will you accept this love I offer which can heal you? I see you're going through tough times and I'm reaching out to help. Are you ready to accept the love I have for you? Being with me, you'll find comfort, strength, and the peace you're looking for. Trust in me. Let my love wrap around you and lead you to full healing and lasting hope. I'm always here for you, thinking about the wonderful blessings I'm going to give you. Blessings that you'll soon see. Listen to what I say to you as I guide you with my words. You mustn't give up. The fight goes on every day. There are crucial things in your life you need to focus on because discouragement doesn't waste time and shows up early, bringing negativity with it. But don't be afraid. I'm with you. Hold on to my hand as we go through this day together. I will talk to you about my promises, promises that will bring about new and amazing miracles in your life. Don't be scared, don't lose courage, and don't look down. Face everything with faith and confidence, because I will visit you every morning to fill your soul with my holy words. Please feel the immense love with which I speak to you. Put your hands on your heart and notice how it beats with joy when you hear my voice. Your soul has no space for loneliness or sadness. Go ahead, look at yourself in the mirror and talk to yourself with faith, repeating the promises I will fulfill for you in this message. Remind yourself of who you are. You are a child of the Almighty God, vibrant with life, and a wonderful future awaits you, full of dreams to achieve and a zest for living splendidly. Say goodbye to the depression that trapped you. Believe in my words and free your mind from all harmful thoughts. With the strength of my love, I'm removing every bit of the past that still clings to your mind, soul, and heart. Your heart should only have space for this Heavenly Father who loves and saved you, and you need to love me with all your strength. I should be your priority in everything you do, and every morning when you wake up, remember that I am here. Say good morning to me with love, because your kind words make me happy. I enjoy hearing your voice and seeing the willingness of your heart. And with your praise, I will richly bless your life and your family. Notice the grace you've received, the immense love you found. Feel this wonderful emotion flowing through you, from your head down to your feet, like tears of joy rolling down your face and touching your heart. Feel my love again, just as you did before. Stand up, shout, and open your arms wide to welcome this downpour of grace from heaven. Accept with an open heart this invitation to be happy in my presence. Bow your head in prayer and embrace this new life. I've lifted you from sadness and renewed your strength. I've removed your pain and filled you with courage so you can stand out and continue to bless many. So I tell you, don't stop, keep going every day. Be brave and strong because I'll take care of the things that seem impossible to you. Remember, Real victories aren't won with weapons or armies, but through the extraordinary power of my Holy Spirit. Do your part and stir up your faith. Don't overlook this message. Don't underestimate what I'm saying. Sit alone in your room with your Bible and read it carefully, because I'll keep talking to you until you're completely sure that you are loved, cared for, and gently protected. You will succeed in everything. Nothing can hurt you. Even the challenges you face will become blessings because I don't make mistakes. I know exactly what I'm doing. And I love you and your family. I'm getting you ready for something great. I want to lift you to this supernatural level. You deserve to live a victorious life. That's why I'm here. To clear your path and defeat your foes mightily. Accept my gift, for you are more than a conqueror already. It's not my desire for you to struggle so much. Open your heart and embrace the peace I'm giving you today. 
and tomorrow when you feel my presence by your bed, your faith will be refreshed and your heart filled with hope. A fantastic blessing is on its way. Welcome it as you've earned it. Your solid faith, hard work, and courage through many trials have kept fear at bay. You show remarkable strength and unwavering character. Only my deep love and gentle care can reach and stir your emotions deeply. Your spiritual sensitivity is keen. You feel my presence enveloping you and can identify spiritual foes trying to battle you. Yet, you stand strong against them, not retreating or showing fear like others might. What lies ahead for you is magnificent. Vast blessings are on their way. My love for you has been proven time and again through tough days, harsh moments and nights when I've comforted your heart gently. I've provided heavenly consolation, and by the next day, you were uplifted, stronger, and had a clear vision of your purpose and wonderful destiny. Your incredible faith is why I'm sending down abundant blessings of spiritual renewal for you and your family. Now is the time for healing. Come close and lay all your troubles and any unforgiveness at my feet. It's time to put aside differences and welcome a wonderful reconciliation. If you're ready for this blessing, let me use you to pour out abundant wisdom, strengthen your character, and help you understand my word better so you can guide your loved ones. Some in your family might not yet be ready to follow me, but they'll start to change when they see how my love and power transform you. Let me work in you. Don't be afraid. You won't be embarrassed. If someone mocks you, or tries to cause trouble, stay kind, because I'll step in. Stop complaining. Fill yourself with my wise teachings. Read my words and let them sink deep into your heart. Love and respect yourself as I do. Show the same patience to your family and everyone else that I have shown to you. Act now, because those miracles you've been waiting for are just around the corner. Those of difficult disposition will change. Those who have lost their way shall find the path back to your home. And when they arrive, let them see you as an exemplar, never fearing to approach you, feeling loved, knowing that your embrace is without reproach or judgment. Pray for them tenderly, without complaint or condemnation. As prodigal children, they will return repentant. You will go out to meet them, and they will run into your arms, weeping. You will receive them with a tender, warm embrace, removing their soiled garments and clothing them in love. You will forgive their transgressions wholeheartedly, even if you do not agree with their way of life, their mistakes or their vices. You are not their judge. I do not send you to punish. Your duty is to love as I have loved you. You have faltered many times, yet I have never shamed you. I have been patient and forgiving. I have given you more than one opportunity, and I shall give you more still, for such is my nature. My faithfulness is boundless, my grace infinite. I forgive you always, but you must acknowledge that your mistakes bear consequences that cause pain. Therefore, be wiser in your choices. Know that you are alive and forgiven through my grace and love because of the patience I show you. I've never treated you as your mistakes deserve. Each morning, come and let me fill you with peace and give you the wisdom you need to rise to a place where you'll gain your family's love and respect. You will lead them on my path, and soon they will all know me because you've shared my message with love and shown them how deeply I care. Faithful servant, Get ready to step into a time of joy and blessings, seeing your whole family come to recognize me as their God and Lord. I want you to know how much I appreciate you. It fills me with joy to see you avoid the trap set by the enemy. My love for you is extraordinary, and I truly want to bless you abundantly. 
I'll fill your life with peace and happiness for every moment you spend with me each day. Let's make a promise. You will feel my love in an extraordinary way, and throughout your day, you'll hear my voice wherever you are, feeling the warmth of my words again. I love you deeply. I'll free you from despair and give you courage. I'm revitalizing your spirit, holding you close with my love. Believe in me. Feel this pure and beautiful sentiment of being loved and protected by the creator of the universe and be filled with immense peace with every word you hear. I speak to you with inspiration that emanates from my heart. These words erase your past and heal your pain. They speak to you of the great value you possess and the beautiful future that awaits you. I love you, believe it. Face this day with courage and determination for I am with you and I shall never let you fall. Let me help you. I see your weariness and how desperate you feel not knowing what to do. I want to deliver you from this situation with my powerful hand. I see how your circumstances are passing, the moments you face. Have you thought that you can bear no more? In a silent cry, you have asked me for help, not wishing anyone to know of your plight. Before others, you appeared joyful, but I have heard your whispered words, confessing your waning desire to live. It pleases me greatly that you have come before me, and with the remaining faith you hold, you can trust that there is much I can do for you. You know this deep within. My presence is filled with my love and power. In my embrace you are safe. Fear can't touch you, and the world can't harm you. I want to protect you, forgive you, save you, set you free, and heal you. I have only the best plan for you. I see your potential. You deserve happiness, to dream big, to work hard, and to achieve greatness. I give you the strength to overcome any barrier. Let my peace wash over you as you hear or read these uplifting words. Trust in me and embrace my love. My help is always here for you, the best choice you can make. I see more than you can. I'm lining up surprises for you. I wish to see you thriving and joyful, strong, and ready for any challenges ahead. Fill your thoughts with visions of success and achievement. Stay quiet, ignoring those discouraging inner voices trying to instill fear or predict failure. The enemy might try to block your path with obstacles, aiming to steer you away from the blessings I've laid out for you. Fear not, for I'm aware that your trials are formidable, but I surpass them. Your adversary may rise menacingly, but my power exceeds theirs. Though illness seeks to rob you of hope, my desire is to heal you. The familial troubles that dishearten and distress you will witness a wondrous miracle, and your circumstances will soon change. Tell me now, will you believe in me or harbor doubt? If you choose belief, you shall rise, persist, and continue the fight. You will undertake all that is required of you with unwavering faith. I know you have suffered and shed tears in solitude over the challenges you face. But today, I envelop you with my affection, drying your tears and offering you the water of life. Your body shall be filled with health, your spirit renewed, and your soul no longer thirsty. Though the enemy seeks to assail you daily and bring you down, today you shall stand firm, upheld by my grace. The recent days have been arduous, but now this difficulty shall come to its conclusion. I love you deeply and will fill you completely with my love, chasing away every fear. Look towards me now. Is there anything too hard for me to do? Just as I stilled storms, split the sea, and helped many to witness miracles and wonders, today I still the turmoil within you. I empower you to tread over the waves of uncertainty. You won't drown because my hand is outstretched towards you. 
underpinned by my compassion. My angels are sent out to guard you as you make your way against the tide, making sure you're supported and don't fall. A heavenly host is paving the way for you, engaging in your struggles. I have pronounced a wealth of blessings over you. Do not fear, for I have triumphed over your fears and adversaries with my strength. I want you to experience a wonderful day in my company. Always remembering that with me by your side, you're more than victorious, for I am leading your battles. Your time of triumph is approaching. Know that I aim to strengthen and elevate you when you're downhearted. Will you let me? You have my word. My blessings are on their way to you. I cherish you for who you are, my child. You are incredibly precious to me. I've laid out an extraordinary plan for you, one that will unfold flawlessly. I will guide you along the path of righteousness, delivering the miracle you seek and the answers you've been waiting for very soon. The things you long for will come to pass if you take time in prayer, seeking me earnestly. If you seek me in the morning, bending your knees before bed, you will realize that many of the answers to your prayers are already before you. If you immerse yourself in my word, your perspective will change. Your character will transform. Even those who mistreat you will begin to change. Your hope will be refreshed. Your smile will shine brighter, and the confidence on your face will earn respect. You've never been a failure, and you never will be. I give you life and strength, the power to rise above challenges, to thrive and find joy. Remember, I resurrected on the third day, and in doing so, you too were lifted. Embrace and believe in this divine strength that will clear the path through your troubled waters, allowing you to step firmly towards your future. In rough waters, I'll be by your side. Through raging rivers, you won't be swept away. Walking through flames won't scorch you. I've endowed you with the ability to overcome dangers and the enemy's force, ensuring nothing can hurt you. My blessings for you are relentless. I guard you, care for you, and love you deeply as I am your father. What I've planned for you is exclusively yours. Pray with belief when you're in need. Reach out to me and I'll respond with wonderful and unseen things. Listen to my words and I'll keep talking to you, telling you about the blessings I have for you and the love I hold for you. Yes, you'll face challenges and troubles, but remember, you belong to me and I cherish you deeply. I'm your shepherd, you won't be in want. Recognize who you are to me. You're chosen, dearly loved, and blessed. If you've just woken up, say my name. If you went to sleep exhausted and woke up feeling troubled, say my name. If your thoughts are clouded with sadness or feelings of defeat, call out to me. Let your foes witness your courage in. Believing in me and standing strong because of your love for me and your unwavering faith. Sing it out, declare it. Your voice is sweet to me. Call on my name from evening till the break of day. Talk to me gently. Tell me you love me just by uttering my name. Soothe your soul and calm your spirit. Silence all threats. Make your adversaries retreat. Let sickness fade away. Let pain disappear completely. Be healed entirely. My power performs wonders in hearts like yours that joyfully proclaim my name at all times. Jesus, I love you. To drive away all evil thoughts, speak it aloud. Jesus, I trust in you to dispel fear and restore strength and courage. Do it. Speak my name with faith and confidence, for it is established that at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that I, Jesus, am the King of kings, the Lord of lords. My spirit shall fill you and never depart from you. When you finally understand that my holy name holds all power, all authority, and that the entire universe awaits eagerly my return, the heavens and the earth may pass away, 
but my word shall remain. In my hands there are blessings you've never even dreamed of. People talk about how powerful the name of Jesus is, but now it's your turn to say it, feel it, and see the amazing things that happen when you do. I invite you to watch as your dreams come true, and I offer help with kindness, mercy, and everlasting love, all wrapped in splendid grandeur to anyone who comes to me with firm belief. Every morning, speak with confidence, because there's holiness in bravery, faith and trust. Hold on to the mighty holy name of Jesus. Believe in Him completely. Don't get discouraged, for tough times are just temporary. If you hold my hand tightly, you'll get through these challenges with grace, showing my strength on your face. Know that you were never abandoned by your Heavenly Father. Even when others doubted you and ignored your troubles, you didn't look to them for comfort because you had me. With your faith, steady or shaky at times, you kept going, and you will keep going. You won't be dragged down by overwhelming forces. You won't give in. This isn't your end. Let your tears turn into tears of happiness as you see the wonderful future that's waiting for you. Your hard times are fading. The problems you're dealing with now will soon be solved. When you feel free, come quickly to me. We will share a fatherly hug and I will take your hand again. Our journey continues and even if you stumble, the way forward is bright. The time is perfect. Let's not wait. Together, we'll start a beautiful new chapter in your life. Open the shutters of your soul. Allow my light to permeate, dispelling despondency. Let the counsel that once instilled fear flee, for when your emotions and senses are suffused with my presence, every vacant chamber within you shall be filled. I shall expel the tormenting memories, for there is no room for them anymore. You have welcomed me. I am here. With my own hand, I shall inscribe in the book of your dreams the myriad splendid plans I have for you. I am light. I am life. From the inception of the universe I had you in mind, and alongside me, the celestial angels awaited this very day. Today, the heavens celebrate as you give me your heart, making me first in everything. Be alert because there's an enemy out there like a roaring lion, wanting to take away your happiness and leave you alone and sad. Remember, I'm the way and the truth. My Holy Spirit will always be there to guide you. Don't go out looking for advice from just anyone who might lead you the wrong way. Listen to what I say, open your Bible, and in it, I will talk to you. Sharing wisdom and stories, showing miracles through others' experiences, and speaking to you tenderly in songs and wise sayings. Learn from those who served me before, who, even though they weren't perfect, were lifted up by their faith in me and truly believed in my promises. They shut the mouths of lions, defeated their enemies, and stood strong. Through hard times, because they knew me and were completely sure about my everlasting kingdom. I don't offer worldly things, but eternal life, the strength of being raised from the dead. I am the door you need to go through. Here with me, you will find love and understanding, healing and bravery, kindness and gentleness, wisdom and patience. Don't waste time looking for approval and love in this tough world. Instead, decide to follow me just as you are. Hold on to your faith in me because I won't let you down. Look, new times are coming for you. While others lose hope and see their plans fall apart, nations might be in turmoil, wealth could vanish, and chances might seem to lessen, but you'll be safe under my powerful protection. Even if thousands fall around you and countless more near you, you won't be harmed. Judgment won't touch you, as you're promised a place in my heavenly home. Right here, you'll keep receiving blessings with enough to live on and new dreams awakening in you. Be encouraged. 
for I'm wrapping you in my love, making sure these aren't just words, but deep truths. Listen carefully, and you'll hear me. I'll rescue you from conflict, scattering those who mean you ill. Hold on to this and declare it with confidence, because your struggles are almost over. Feel the comfort of my embrace, for my words aren't hollow. When I speak, you trust, for my voice is gentle and true. Don't focus on the problem ahead, but on the strength I'm giving you. A strength that surpasses all that's ordinary. Arise, go forth with this spirit and these fortitudes bestowed upon thee. Thou shalt conquer armies and leap over walls. Tell me thou wilt, I shall reiterate it. No ill tidings shall overcome thee. The physician's diagnosis shall not dismay thee. Any threat of familial estrangement shall not diminish thy joy. Your feelings might make you think there's nothing left to do, that upcoming troubles will overcome you, that hurtful words from others will break you, that you won't bounce back from this hardship, and that joy will forever stay out of reach. But I've brought you to this moment so you can hear my message and be assured that I'm looking out for you deeply concerned about everything you face. I see the numerous negative influences surrounding you. They seem to sense a significant blessing coming your way. It's no accident that they trouble and distress you now, right when you're close to achieving many of your dreams. Don't be afraid of your enemies thinking they're strong. You are stronger. They try to scare you, but you will stand firm. They won't see the wonderful surprise you're about to reveal. I've given you the power to quiet the forces of evil that have crept into the minds of those against you. Don't think you're alone or without protection. Refresh your mind and feed your soul, mind, and spirit with my teachings and commandments. I've told you before and I'll say it again. Be brave and put in the effort. The enemy is testing you with its attacks, trying to see who is more powerful. No matter how big your problems seem, they can't harm you because I, the Almighty, am with you. You live under my protection and care. I've cleansed you with my blood and filled you with my Holy Spirit. I'm not just strong. I'm all-powerful and you are my child, made in my image and likeness. This is good news that should fill your soul and lips with praise. Now tell me, will you truly believe in me, my child? Take a moment to calm down. Come to me and share what's on your heart. I fully grasp the pain you're going through. You feel down and your patience is running thin. You've tried to help many and have given your love, yet you've been let down by others. Remember, I also gave everything for love. I was crucified, left alone, beaten, and hurt. So, put your trust in me. I understand the depth of your pain, and when I see you cry, I completely get it. Don't be afraid to show me your emotions. I won't judge you. I want to listen to you. As you talk, I'll hold you gently and give you my peace to ease your troubled heart under my holy covering. I will wipe away your tears and protect you from the cold sting of disappointment. I will lift your spirits and fill you with my warmth, kindling the flame of my Holy Spirit in your heart. Feel blessed that in these trying times, your Heavenly Father, who loves you deeply, is here to comfort you. You don't need to seek love and understanding from others. Beside me, you have all you need. It hurts me to see you sometimes. Forget that no one in this world loves you more than I do. Don't lose the peace I give you so easily. Ignore the mocking of those who ridicule you. Stay calm. Don't give in to anger or frustration. Ignore those who hurt you. Don't sink to their level. Don't worry, the enemy wants you to feel forsaken, but I will handle it. Come to me and stay in my presence. Find shelter in my embrace when everything seems wrong and you're battling impatience. Don't put all your hope and trust in people. Don't entrust your life, love, and future 
to anyone but me. In the world, you will face difficulties, but with me, you will always be safe. I have overcome sorrow and disappointment. Fill yourself with my presence, and everything will be all right. Do you believe? Amen. My beloved child, today marks the end of every curse and the cessation of all lack and sickness in your life. Every negative event, those thoughts of defeat, the deep sadness that saps your energy and the overwhelming frustration, all of it ends right now. Hold on to your faith because you know of my love for you and that I am always here to lift you up. Therefore, I will turn your mourning into dancing, giving you the power to face life's hurdles. I'm aware of the daily struggles you endure. I understand. There are times when you feel caught in a never-ending cycle of troubles. But it's important for you to realize that each difficulty in your life is designed to strengthen you and bring you closer to me. I've given you a spirit of power, love, and self-discipline not fear. With my help, you can conquer any challenge and endure any trial. The enemy may try to make you feel defeated, trapped, or overwhelmed by circumstances beyond your control. Yet this is not your reality. I have designed specific plans for you. Plans for your good, not disaster. To provide you with hope and a promising future. I aim to prosper you, not to leave you stranded. Your fate is not shaped by worldly conditions, but by my everlasting love and steadfast promises. Every time you stumble, I'll be right there to pick you up. When you're feeling weak, just remember, my strength works best in your weakness. My grace is all you need. My power shines brightest when you're vulnerable. So if you're feeling down or overwhelmed, just look to me and I'll refresh your strength and your faith. The struggles you're going through, they're really just chances for you to grow, to learn, and to become stronger. Be glad when you face tough times because they teach you to be persistent. And through these challenges, you become stronger and get ready to receive the good things I've planned for you. Keep your heart safe, for it's the source of all your life. Don't be swayed by what others say or think about you. Remember who you are. You belong to me, the Almighty God. On your journey, you're never alone. I've assigned angels to watch over and guide you. Even when you walk through the darkest paths, you don't need to be scared, because I'm right there with you. Now's the time to stand up, to embrace what's rightfully yours, and to uh, bravely move toward the future I've laid out for you. Trust in me wholeheartedly without relying solely on your own perceptions. Acknowledge my presence in all aspects of your life, and I'll guide you on the right path. Let me be your safe haven, your strength, your navigator. Together we'll journey towards a life rich in blessings, purpose, and triumph. Remember, those who find shelter in me will always find peace in my protective presence. In me, you'll find a reliable refuge and unshakable strength. When life's challenges overwhelm you, remember I'm your protector and stronghold. Seeking refuge in me means no misfortune will touch you, no calamity will approach your home. I've instructed my angels to look after you in every situation, keeping you safe so that you won't even graze your foot on a stone. Do not fear the night's terrors or the trials that come with daylight, for you belong to me. I promise to save you and give you honor. Call on me, and I'll respond. I'll be there in times of trouble, to save you and celebrate you. My word and your faith are sufficient to activate this supernatural and transformative power. But I require your trust and loyalty. Your future is in my hands, and I promise to give you a long life and show you my salvation. No matter the threats that surround you, you will always be safe in my presence. I am your refuge in times of distress. 
when the world seems to crumble around you, I am the immovable rock to which you can cling for fearlessness. Do not allow fear to paralyze you or deter you from your dreams and purposes. I am your protector and guide, and with me, you will face and overcome any adversity. Remember that my love for you is eternal, and I will always be here to protect, care for, heal, and comfort you. Believe, and you will see a powerful miracle in your life today. Endure a little longer, you can do it. Look at how far you have already come and all that you have achieved, even when you feel weak and thought you wouldn't make it. To where you are today, remember, to resist, to persevere, to persist. I'm with you. You must do it. After this difficult time passes, your relationship with me will be stronger than ever. When this storm ends, you will be firmer than ever and absolutely nothing will be able to knock you down or break you. You might wonder why I've allowed you to face such hard times. You might think I left you alone or was punishing you, but that's not true. I have an incredible plan for your life, filled with abundant blessings. The challenges you've faced are setting the stage for greater things, for blessings beyond your expectations. Immerse yourself in my words. They are a treasure and guidance for you. Don't waste your time on baseless fears or judge others harshly, harboring grudges or resentment. Devote every day, every hour, every minute to me. Focus on my words, which bring peace and strength to your soul. Leave the negative and harmful experiences in the past. I'm making your heart new. Let go of your burdens and forget what prevents you from truly understanding and trusting me from embracing the wonderful blessings I have for you. Liberate your spirit from past hurts. Let go of the bitterness and free your mind from thoughts that cause pain. If you feel you have no words for me, if you don't feel like speaking, come to me anyway. Kneel before me in silence. I want to accompany you in your moments of solitude, embrace you with affection, and show you once again how much I love you. Even when you don't speak to me, I understand what your heart is saying to me. I know perfectly well what you are feeling. Believe me, I have a new future for you. Great blessings are coming. Expect them soon. I love you. I'm touching your heart at this very moment, bringing calm to your thoughts. I'm breathing life and health into your soul, your spirit, your mind, and your body. Breathe in this strength which you receive today from my Holy Spirit, Pay no heed to the venomous criticisms of people. You are not a sad, dull, bitter, or finished individual, whether you have contemplated it yourself or someone has spoken it to you. Those are myriad falsehoods. Understand this clearly. My eyes do not perceive the passing years on your calendar. I delight in seeing you celebrate, yet I do not count your birthdays. My love does not judge you by your gray hairs or the imperfections of your skin. To me, you are a beautiful person, lacking nothing. Your faith, simplicity, and the grace you carry in your spirit truly delight me. I surround you with my powerful presence. I wish for you to start today filled with the Holy Spirit, feeling my tender embrace. Turn away from the disappointments and tough challenges of yesterday. Look towards me. I am your healer, your shield, and your provider. The words I speak to you will strengthen you, embedding themselves in your thoughts, lighting your way, showing you the hurdles in your life, and giving you the wisdom to make the right choices. Every day I have fresh blessings for you. Take joy in finding them. Take pleasure in accepting them. When you kneel and thank me, a sacred oil anoints your spirit, healing your emotions and sentiments. You are fully protected. None of your blessings will go missing. I will place you in a lush and fruitful land where you will thrive and prosper. Everything taken from you by the enemy will be returned, increased, and blessed. You are mine. You belong to me. You radiate bravery and happiness 
Your spirit's kindness touches those around you. Your vibrant and spirited nature is magnificent with a heart full of beauty. You are my child. When I hear you speak to me professing your love, my eyes tear up and my heart swells with tenderness and affection. I saw how frightened you were, how worried, and I heard your heart cry out. You desired to escape the problem. You asked for my help urgently. You begged me to come with my mighty hand, assuring you that your situation would be resolved. I understand you well. This issue is crucial. A lot hinges on sorting out this problem. You couldn't fix it alone and thought I was displeased with you, reluctant to aid you. But grasp this, you'll always need me, in good times and bad, amid success or hardship. Never forget that. Stay vigilant as the enemy aims to exploit any weakness, aiming to shatter your faith, disrupt your plans, and hurt you deeply. I'm here to help with the challenge you're facing now. It saddens me to see you troubled and in distress. I don't wish for you to suffer. Instead of fixating on the same worries, hand them over to me. If you sense defeat looming in your thoughts, reject it. It's not the reality. You won't be defeated because you trust in the Almighty God. If despair starts to seep into your heart, push it away. For giving in to it would be a serious mistake. A believer in my might, awaiting my intervention, shouldn't lose heart. If you find your will to live waning, lean on your faith. You believe and serve a powerful and sovereign God who will ignite the fire of divine love in your heart and fill you with a marvelous desire to continue fighting. You must cling to the promises I am giving you. Hold on to these words I speak to you. Ignore those who try to bring you down, saying you don't deserve to live. Their words shouldn't affect you anymore. I want you to thrive, and soon you'll experience my blessings anew. Your current troubles will fade away. Your life will get better. The issues that worry you will be resolved. Listen, my child, it's no coincidence you're hearing this. Tell me you believe in me, that you'll keep fighting no matter what, and that your love for me remains steadfast. I love you deeply. I want you to feel confident today and forever, knowing that I am the source of your joy and future, not anything or anyone else. I alone have sacrificed myself for you. My blood has atoned for your sins. I rose again in power and glory, so you could have a full life. You've known loneliness, endured pain, faced life's darkest moments, and sometimes felt close to despair. Yet you remembered my love for you, cried out in your suffering. And even in your dreams, you reached out to me. I've always been there for you, healing your hurts, forgiving your mistakes, and reigniting your faith. You came out on top, having grasped the lesson well, and now you're back in the fray for your dreams, buoyed by my promises. You're brave and determined, aware that you are cherished deeply by your Father in heaven. I'm presenting you with an opportunity you shouldn't overlook. It was bought at a high price, my own sacrifice. You owe it to yourself and your family not to disregard it. Give it your all in the struggle. You can't stay put. Today I'll equip you with the necessities, but you must use what I provide wisely, your time and your energy. Avoid companions who chase mere illusions. Place your hope, not in people or material things that might let you down. I have blessed you with a vibrant heart, love to fuel your fight, and the boldness to advance without fearing defeat. The old things are behind. Everything I do for you is new, it is wonderful. I have chosen to give it to you because you are pleasing in my sight, but do not lose these gifts. Do not commit to debts or projects without careful consideration without seeking my will or asking for my counsel. Do not make promises you will not keep. Do not bear burdens that are not yours to bear. Be wise, prudent, and patient. I'm going to renew your life 
and position you as a leader in your family and community, earning their respect. Witness the wonders I perform for someone who genuinely loves, serves, obeys, and believes in me. Share this good news with those dear to you and get ready to see my promise fulfilled in your life. I've reserved the best for you. My blessings will find you. What you think you've lost is nothing compared to the blessings that await. Even if it's hard to see now, there's a reason behind everything I do. I give you what you truly need. For every moment of sadness, expect countless moments of joy. Financial struggles will give way to divine abundance. In place of sickness, you'll find healing. Every conflict will be resolved, and my protection will shield you in dangerous times. Rest assured, you're safe with me. Don't lose hope. Just trust in me. Remember, my vision extends beyond what is visible, and I discern precisely what is best for you. I hear your prayers, your dreams, and what I have prepared for you surpasses your imagination. Therefore, do not linger in sadness, for I am not subtracting from your life. Rather, I am making space in your hands to receive and hold this grand gift, my blessing, vast and imminent. Embrace it, believe in it, await it with unwavering faith, for soon it shall arrive. Every blessing I give you is for your benefit and will also enrich your family. Promise to trust me, affirm your faith in me, make a commitment to seek me daily, come to me for your blessings every morning. I look forward to your presence. Let your faith be steadfast and burning bright. You're on the edge of an extraordinary change in your life, your personality, your thinking, and your goals. All will be transformed by my Holy Spirit's anointing, which I generously bestow upon you. To fully embrace this new existence, you must remain firm in your faith and trust. Don't fear stepping into the unfamiliar, for I will empower you and supply your needs. I see what lies beyond your vision and know what's best for you. Believe in my love for you. Come, let's talk. Share with me all that's in your heart. Speak freely, for I've always assured you that your mistakes don't push me away. I understand you deeply, and even if you hesitate to accept it, I love you just as you are. I will make you aware of this vast love, and when you accept it, hold it close. Experience this pure, unmatched love unlike anything else in this world. Cherish this moment, this profound, genuine feeling beyond any earthly love. Sometimes you might think I set conditions to bless you greatly. Just give me your heart, my child. That's all I ask, and you've already done that. Your heart belongs to me, even if you sometimes forget amid life's distractions. Don't compare me to those who judge you, trying to impose their rules, manipulating and taking from you. They falsely claim to speak for me, creating sins and punishments to trap you, making you think I'm the one who judges and punishes harshly. My death on the cross wasn't pointless. I gave my blood for every sin you've committed, whether out of ignorance, defiance, or weakness. I've consistently shown you love, offering forgiveness that you've joyfully accepted, renewing your faith. So here we are, talking. I'm giving you a divine insight. This is real, not your imagination. You'll understand and feel my love more deeply from now on, every single day. It will empower you every morning, letting you start fresh, eager to live, do good, help your family and support others. Banish all fear from your heart. Make ample room for my blessings. You shall feel my presence in your life in a beautiful and special manner, commencing today. You shall not forget this. I love you. Your future isn't in human hands. It's me who opens doors for you as I decide. I'll shower you and your family with all my love. Nothing can pull you away from me. My love for you is forever. 
My view of you won't change. Even if you make many mistakes, my grace and forgiveness are always ready for you. I am with you always. Here's my everlasting promise. I'll never leave you or forget about you. Don't be afraid. I'm right here, so don't lose heart. Don't let the negativity around you weaken your faith. I'm your God, your parent, your ruler, your pal. I'll give you strength and help. I'll show up just when you need me to display my power and show I have plans for you. No matter what, I'll always love you. I found you when you were weakest to show how much you mean to me. I'll never get tired of saying this, and I hope you never tire of hearing it. No attack against you will succeed, and those who criticize you will see their words fall. Those spreading lies are speaking ill of you, and your family are really opposing me. Stay strong in your belief. Don't let anyone sway you from this truth that you need to embrace. Soak in my word that brings life, not in the harmful words of others. Listen to me every day as I talk about my everlasting love, so all doubt, sadness, and depression may leave your heart. You are my child and our bond is secured with my blood. Do not fear, for I am with you. I grant you strength, peace, and might. Declare this, from today onwards, you will overcome and everything will change. Have faith in what I promise. Be diligent and brave. Trust in me and all will transform. I address your soul with words that will chase away every uncertainty, every confusion, you are encircled by my heavenly protection, with legions of angels ready at my command to defend you, to look after your family, and to protect you from the cunning enemy aiming to trap you. A marvelous time of peace and abundance is coming. I want you to soar high like the eagle, and from those heights, behold how your family changes and is greatly blessed by your beautiful faith. My love and my blessing are with you. Never doubt it. This morning understand that I heard your prayer last night when you cried, your thoughts heavy under your pillow. I saw your fear, your tears asking me for bravery, strength, peace, and the confidence to meet life's challenges. Now you wake to a new day, feeling refreshed and strong, ready to face any challenge. Fear has turned into faith and despair into determination. You were shaky yesterday, worried about potential troubles, but today you stand solid, prepared to overcome. Stand up and march forward. I've filled you with a burning desire to win. Trust in my might. If I've brought you this far, it's because I guide and empower you to confront and vanquish countless challenges. The hurdles you encounter might seem large, but remember, Nothing surpasses my care. I brought you here and have never left your side. I will be with you forever, for your side in all the struggles, battles, and wars you must face in this life. You are more than a conqueror through my power and love. Every giant that rises against you rises to be defeated. I bestow upon you the firmness and determination necessary to overcome any conflict. Your goal is to surpass all challenges that come your way, to live in abundance and complete peace. Right now it's crucial for you to shift your focus from your concerns and set your eyes on me. This situation is all part of a bigger plan designed to deepen your faith through my words. Fill your thoughts with my promises and let all your fears dissolve in my presence. With me in your heart, you can stand up to anything. You'll come out on top of every challenge. Stand up and press on, empowered by my love. When this day draws to a close, talk to me again. Let's have a chat, and I'll bless you in a special way. Stand up and move forward. Combat your struggles with the strength of my spirit. In any fight, you'll be unbeatable. You are not frail, you're imbued with strength. You possess my love and your faith. And remember, for those who believe, nothing is impossible. 
I cherish you. Invite me into your space today. Open every door and window of your life to me. Let my divine blessing come in, bringing healing to your spirit and peace to your heart. Just yesterday, you purified your home from all that's negative. I revitalized each corner. With my word, I stirred the very foundations of your mind, clearing out the residues of past pains. You're now clean, redeemed, and forgiven. Now it's time to embrace this truth. I'm not saying you're without flaws or beyond temptation. You are my child, and I cherish you, but remember, you're human. You'll continue this journey grasping my hand. Should you commit to seeking me daily, loving me with all your heart and soul, and surrendering your life entirely to me, I promise to be by your side, ready to pick you up and aid you in moving forward, even when you falter. I'm aware that you don't intend to sin. I recognize that in your struggles you might be knocked down, smeared with mud, while your adversaries sneer, trying to shame you by seeing you fall. Yet you'll look up to me. I've placed you in this battle, and it's my responsibility to cleanse, empower, and absolve you anew. That's a constant. You must persevere regardless of the opposition. Your foes are vile and ruthless. They lack compassion or remorse with their consciences numbed. They're jealous of the triumphant grace I've draped over you and will exploit every tactic to assail you, attempting to rob the peace you found. You're paying attention to my words and I see you understand them. You have a deep love for your family and desire their success. You recognize that achieving this requires effort, dedication, reliance on your faith and trust in my words. You will receive immense blessings and your adversaries are aware of this, attempting to hinder you. They misjudged you, seeing you as vulnerable, never anticipating that you would turn to me, admitting your frailties and transgressions. That is why I decided you would be forgiven, elevated, and made prosperous. I am with you daily, and no one can overpower you, demean you, bring you down, or overcome you. Should you stumble, I will be there to raise you up. This is my pledge to you, and it shall come to pass. Your family and entire household, even those at a distance, will experience my presence in a fresh and extraordinary manner. Your prayers bring me joy. Your faith is pleasing to me. It fills me with immense happiness to observe how you dedicate time to me each morning, offering your honesty, reverence, petitions, praise, and adoration. Your willingness to give me your heart delights me profoundly. Your faith is authentic and true. Though many situations in your life have tarnished the image you held of yourself, Today I implore you to hear it from my own lips. You possess a benevolent heart. True, you have faltered many times, yet each time you have come before me repentant and seeking another opportunity. It is this new opportunity that I wish to bestow upon you whenever you approach me with faith. Be assured that my promise to you is steadfast. Whenever you pray, fully expecting to receive, I will answer. Have no doubts. I will take action at the right time. I count on your patience to wait for that perfect moment. Keep your eyes on the coming blessings. My promises are reliable. My word is everlasting. And my power is actively shaping your life. Your faith and commitment are what sustain you. I depend on your faith to perform even more wonders in your life. Welcome the blessings I send and step away from any past disbelief. You now understand the value of feeling deserving and having faith. You have learned from your experiences and have matured. You've realized that your faith is crucial for making important choices, protecting your heart from harm and living out my instructions. 
Even if your faith is as tiny as a mustard seed, it is immense and splendid. In my perspective, you witness the transformations occurring around you, your prayers are being answered and your heart is strengthening. There are even greater miracles awaiting you in the place where I lead you. Hold on to my hand tightly. We're nearly there. As you go through today, remember that no obstacle can defeat you if you keep your faith strong, knowing that I'm in control of your future. I am the source of all your blessings. Stay close to me, finding refuge under my protection when worries arise. Turn to me and feel the peace I provide. Don't fall for the lie that your challenges are too great. My power is far greater, and your faith is powerful. Rely on me, not on people, jobs, or chance for your well-being, happiness, and peace. Whenever you need help, reach out to me and I will provide. But don't just sit idly. Move forward with faith towards what lies ahead. Don't let the world's chaos sway you. I am your true strength. Only I can fully support, strengthen, broaden your horizons, and increase your joy. Remember the tough times you faced before, when you felt all alone and called out for help. Even though it seemed like I wasn't there, I lifted you up and showed you just how much I care. I've kept on showing you my love ever since. So now, when you're so close to achieving your dreams, don't start doubting. It's not the time to get shaky or let uncertainty cloud your thoughts. Think back to those times when things went wrong because you rushed in without stopping to think, pray, or seek my guidance. You might have turned away from me, but I never turned away from you. That's why I'm telling you again, give me all your worries and let your heart be at ease. Today, I'm filling you with the bravery you need to go places, talk to the right people, and stand up for what's important. I will be right there with you, making sure your dreams come true. With me on your side, you lack nothing. I cherish you deeply. <laughs>